got Megalodon back out here at Outlaw Armageddon, one of the loudest cars on the property by far. Uh, this car is just nuts. Tell me what you run on the car. We've heard it a couple times. You changed much up this year? Uh, no, this year we went to a bigger tire. It's uh, last year, of course, I had a had a crankshaft explode on me. Yeah. So we built a new engine for it, and we brought it out. We were fighting a littler tire. We made some modifications. We put the bigger tire on it. Uh, we're learning it, just taking some time. So what are you running a Megalodon? What's the motor and blower combo? It's an F3 136 Pro Charger. Yeah. Uh, it's a 521 cubic inch Hemi. Okay. Uh, turbo 400 transmission. Fab 9, of course. You know. Yep. Uh, I had a Dana 60 in this car when I originally had it, and you just uh, you don't have much gear ratio. Uh, what do you tune it with? Uh, fast fuel injection. Fast uh, oh, okay. ECU. Yes. Uh, is it very heavy? Uh, 2,800 pounds. Really? So it's it, not this, super heavy, but... It's not super heavy, but it's not super light. This has still got the A-pillar, the glass windshield, glass back, you know, uh, still like got the chrome on it. Was, uh, this was a 69 RSSS Camaro. What's your guess on power? When you I'd say it? most of the time on no... It could probably make around 3,000 uh, maxed out, but on these tracks, man, you can't use them so much. No. You know, well, this is your fourth Armageddon, right? Yes, it is. When I originally came to Armageddon, I came. Uh, my first one, I had to, my first two, I had to race my way in. Uh, then they invited me, Nick, Mark, and them. They invited me. Uh, so that was a. Uh, I paid my dues, so to speak. Well, hopefully this is your lucky weekend. I hope it is, Barty. This car was doing good last night. Good, strong competitors out here. This is anybody's race. You don't take anybody lightly. Definitely. Well, good luck, man. Thank you, brother. I great. appreciate your time. on him. Getting into $50,000 quarterfinals for the big tire class. We've got some crazy matchups. We've got Fireball versus Larry Larson, Stinky Pinky versus Crazy Twin Turbo Mustang. We've got the Twin Turbo Fox against Chuck, it looks like, and some more crazy matchups. This is going to get wild. We're going to see some badass racing. It just cooled down, the clouds came. It's going to be awesome. Last time I talked to you, a year ago. Yeah. Something like that. <laughs> I understand you guys are one and one now. Yes, we are. He got me. Uh, he got me at the. Uh, we we're at another race. And he he got me. Uh, he was, I was definitely owed So. <laughs> but it ought to be a good race for the final. Hell yeah. Both of us going to take a swing at it. I'm sure. We'll see what happens. Fifty grand. Fifty G's. A lot of money. It's be a fun race. Good luck, guys. Time. Thank you, brother. <laughs> Yeah, we just do that. You take right things. I figured you've been to the bike. Good time. All right, bro. Good luck. Right. Good luck, guys. Hey. Good luck, guys.
something to eat, bro. Get some money. How'd the pass feel? Felt good. There toward the end, I just let off of it. I mean, I, I kind of knew he wasn't there because you couldn't hear him. Yeah. You know? No offense. I mean, I, you know, you just... It's you got a unique sound it. compared to your it car. It does. Most certainly does. So, you know, what? no sense in pushing it for the next day. Uh, so, yeah, we got love... A lot more money we'll tomorrow. Race tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Good Fantastic. job, man. Congrats. Fantastic. Just talked to Chuck, the official word is he lost first gear in his transmission, that's why he didn't leave the line. He's heading to the shop, grab another transmission, and go again tomorrow for some more big money. So hopefully we'll see him in the finals again, maybe against Megalodon. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. 